So I failed to find a card. Um, it's not our phones, right? Nice. Nice. 28. Roll up. Continue exploring. Head to party. If I continue exploring, will it go up? It would be really fun if this part of the game, the decision at this part of the game was literally, will you stand here and wait until their phones get live action charged to a higher bar, in which case it doesn't die soon at some point in the later game and you can use it? There's no point in exploring here. I I'm pretty sure I can't I can't do anything, so I guess we'll just leave. 28. Hey, Alright, cool. Let's go. Is he also, you're both cool with 28%. These guys must live so close to here if they think this is going to get them anywhere on the drive home. It's horrible. <laughs> so bad. Maybe maybe if we had chosen to like go down into the basement again, he would have hung out there. Like I feel like it's just the more we do here, the more charged we get, the cooler the phone isn't going to die later. It's a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. You holding a stick? I thought they're he was holding a gun. There's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. They Ooh, the height difference. To People be loving that crap. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Why? Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Shortcut. It's called I always steal the car and I drive right up to it as soon as you start because I don't want to miss a go? single second of your beautiful face. Why don't you choose? it doesn't matter we're just wandering around we've got sticks rocky road shady glade so this sounds safer but if that little video they showed me at the beginning of the game says anything it's that the thing that sounds safer more dangerous full of like spiders and venomous scorpions rocky road sounds like ice cream we can go for some ice cream good choice better sticks this way Rip. better sticks yeah oh you know what like burning or whatever shady glade Trees or shady, there's probably more sticks over there. I'm pretty sure this means nothing and they're both the same, but come on. You guys could get more sticks than this. What, like three sticks? Yeah, I think that's probably good. Uh, not yet. <laughs> oh wow, it's so positive. Why are these guys so wholesome? Oh, I'm a leader? That way leads to nothing. This way leads to a hike. I think I can only go forward. Okay, this is where we all pray that the, the secret tarot card for this section is in the woods and not in the convenience store that I might have missed. Oh my god, look at his head. Jeez, man, he's got like owl flexibility. But I haven't seen him purposely on his own volition do something cool. Please, a tarot card. Quartarize? Quartzite? So this place was an actual quarry? Uh, yeah. Apparently some of the caves are in pretty deep. Why would it's they like name it that otherwise? There. Cool. Alright, fun facts. How many- I feel like all of you people have worked here for like multiple summers. Treasure chest? No, it's just a boring old wooden sign. Danger, falling rocks. Hmm, have you considered holding an umbrella above your head? Weak? Are you sure this is safe? Yes. What, are you scared? No. Are you? You're a little no. cross-eyed, aren't you, kid? Well, this one looks safe, and this looks like we'll get crushed by rocks. But the game isn't gonna have us die to stupid crap like going through a rocky canyon, right? Because that'd be boring. They want us all to die to monsters and dudes who are hunting people. If they killed us here, A, it would crush the only wholesome thing happening in the game, which honestly I expect fully to happen at some point, but B, so predictable. There has to be a card here. I heard a thing. I hear, I hear rock sounds. I'm gonna back up a little bit. You're trying to tempt me? Certainly. There has to be one inside of this rocky road. You're right. Maybe it's only the specific path. Take the more danger path and give me the secrets. Feed me the secrets. If there is a hole in the wall, I would stick my hand so far in there. I'm not even afraid of scorpions. Is that just a tree? I think it's just a tree. I swear I'm gonna look up one day and just see the old man like pushing a rock like freaking Wile E. Coyote onto our heads. And yet, no, Shit. we're gonna die. All right, calm down. <laughs> I like how this girl's trying to flirt by just being not afraid of things, but like why? It's like if you were trying to romance this dude, so you like took him to the Grand Canyon and said, let's just walk on the edge, you know? Oh, she's trauma bonding. Everyone in this game just wants to trauma bond so hard. Well, we lived. 
We're definitely too far away from either wall to logically be hit by a rock, I think, at this point, so we're good. We did it! So, you ever think about what's next? Hmm. Well, I was planning like, on moving to your state, after so... After we die? It's heavy, man. No, I mean, like, the future. Yeah. Sometimes. All the time. It's so overwhelming. Think about death all the time, mean. yeah. Sometimes I just try to, like, let it happen, you know? What? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like, it's all predetermined. He's just trying to drop facts about the game. I hope he doesn't become creepy. Because this kind of makes it think he's going to be creepy. I wouldn't call it that exactly. I'm not sure we're, we're supposed to know. Wow, he's just suddenly being really in-depth about stuff. I wouldn't call it that uncertain. You're not supposed to know it's predetermined, or what happens? I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. Fate just seems so... convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? Wow, they're trying to bash me for controlling someone to do something I never bad. I really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's, it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no. Yeah, whatever totally. makes you like me more, honestly. I could believe any of the crap that you spout right now as long as you let me kiss you later. Maybe behind the old tree trunk? We're so incredibly lost. There's no way that walking through danger pines was the exact way to get to the campsite. A staircase! Wow, beautiful. Okay. If the tarot card is just hiding in some random ass bush somewhere, then that's so stupid. You'd have to explore so hard to find every tarot card. They were just randomly placed like that. All right, we've got nine I sticks now. We we've are. doubled our progress. Yeah. Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. <sighs> Smells like kissing pee. If you kiss on this log, this you're together forever. Just... Wow. Oh no, you just drew it earlier. What are you gonna draw it with pencil? You can't capture the beauty of the sun with a pencil graph. You call yourself an artist. You're gonna sit here, he's just gonna stand here for the next two hours while she makes like a quick portrait. And see, you're really good. Playful. Do me. Now let's be playful. I already told her she was good at art. We have to do something new, something do exciting. Me. Oh wow. Oh, well, that was sorry, the most I'm playful thing this guy has done down. the entire game so far. Right. He's trying to concentrate. Sorry. Dumb idea. Whoa. I just want to finish this. I thought you liked him. Now he feels embarrassed. If I was him, I would feel so embarrassed that I would stop trying to do this. If those sticks. You can scooch over. An awkward little middle school boy. Just scooch over a little bit. He likes her because her red hair matches his shirt. Huh? It's probably nothing. Sparrow. Hey, listen. There's something there. A rabbit squirrel. A little warthog. Oh, that's spooky. Aren't those grown things really spooky? It's so tiny. The baby. There's gotta be a mama somewhere. Look, it's got blood on its mouth. It's oh spooky. God, he's so cute. It's just going to be a mama that's going to attack us. We're going to have to use our, our fire sticks to throw at it. Save Abby. Oh my god, I could just fail to save Abby. Oh crap, is he going to die? He just fell forward. He's not dead. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Yeah, it came from that bush. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is How often is this dead? gonna happen? Is Ian the Watch man dog also like this? Or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Pick the right moment? Oh, there's so many Keep things warm. involved. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's queen. Aww, I thought it was purely just decisions. I have to actually do game-related things. I have to have skills and stuff. Oh, 
How will I know when it's safe? Dude, you're flinching so hard. Your hand is twitching, your face is twitching. God, it's still here! Oh, he saw me! Oh crap, I was too early! Oh, come on. Why wasn't it attacking her? Abby. She just stood there and he was just like smelling the guy on the ground. Abby was standing there doing stuff. That's stupid. He almost just mowed me to death. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, little piggy hog. It's still here? Oh, it's not gonna maul anyone. Obviously, it's quite tame. Fearful, imagine the story. Pedantic. It's actually a bore. Fearful. Man, I almost died, but I guess I didn't. That was predetermined, so there was never really a threat here, says his logic. At least we gave her a good story to tell a pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? Mm, I got a pretty good look. <laughs> Ew! I think she was coming on to me. Oh. Aww. Got yourself a little girlfriend. Uh, she wasn't that little. <laughs> The romantic music kicks back in. Oh, you know when you bond over almost being mauled by a dirty pig in the woods? It was a great, successful date. Guess we should head back. Alright. Yep. Look at all the sticks we have. She's not even bringing hers, but does he have all of them? This is not going to be a large fire. I know we said it was going to be a huge shebang, but actually we have nine sticks, two bags of Doritos, and a few watermelons, so it might not be as cool as we thought. Everyone gets one half of a beer. Oh hey, what are you doing, girl? I don't even know your name. Caitlin? All along? <sighs> Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. You can take selfies in the woods, that's kind of fun. You're not gonna go up there by yourself, are you? Oh, you're just gonna inspect. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna zoom in on somebody in the window. I bet. How do I zoom? I wanted to zoom in. Crap! I missed my chance. Okay, Dylan, if you have a camera, can you tell me that there's an old man looking hey, through the window? I swear. Guess it. what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. Yeah. No, that's not. Whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Knock it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Which I feel oh, like makes sense if you you're trying to protect kids, weird? you know? Well, he's got a perimeter check. Yeah, 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 it makes sense. So probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Everything ready? She's like, oh, he knows. He knows that I haven't done literally shit all since everyone walked away and I'm just kind of doing a commander role. Weird light in the treehouse? No service. I didn't see that. Um, but I believe it. I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Ryan. This photo is really horrible, so don't trust it. I didn't know how to zoom. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. Well, I'm not gonna call it my girlfriend. Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Are you done? First, say it one more time. Summon her. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. Really? Are you not coming back, lady? You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists phone? don't make themselves. They have 23%. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right, guy. Time to get wood. What? Yikes. Wording. Abby and Nick have, oh, like, three sticks on the way here. Abby, Nick! Just in time. Look at all the wood we got. Look at that so we much wood. wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. Oh, then why did we do this? We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Nice. He's dead now, but I'm still here and I brought like twice as many sticks as I would have if he was there. So it's pretty cool. Playful, the hog of Hackett's Quarry. Serious, you both okay? Well, you're gonna be nice all of a sudden? Honestly, uh, do it. Are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. It wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Fireworks! Whoa. Whoa. 
Special delivery! You were nowhere that close. Come on. How did whoa, you set whoa, whoa. those off just then? Where the hell did that gun come from? From the gun Relax, store. Okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. You found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. Oh, Caitlin's smart. And, and we bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter, pop. Why does he know this? Isn't pop, he, like, pop, British pop, or something? Mouth. Pop, I didn't even know you could still find these anywhere. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. A whole you bag? Just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. This dude, Emma, Nick does just some random silly shotgun. stuff that it feels like what, against his nature, you know? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Oh, manhunt. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Yeah, you're good. He's good. Jacob is less cool and Nick is more cool now. Stern. No, not you leaving with a gun. Not a great idea. Okay. Important decision making. Did we pretend to shoot things, accidentally shoot the bad guy? Being a positive thing. Or not play with the gun and lose the gun somehow. Not leaving you with a gun? Not a good idea. I don't really want Jacob to have the gun, but I think there that Nick no could probably shoot pretty Dylan well. Dylan with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there. Okay? There's a shooting fun. range? Okay, look, you Why? And me, old fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? You're gonna risk like killing somebody in the woods for this? Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy. Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about it. Oh, wow. You can be the ref. You can give that up really quick. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Are you well, loading it? He's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. She gave in so There's easy. a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. Yep. Does that not constitute dicking around? I think we've preemptively lost the bet. It's fine. Some beautiful music for our little shootout activity. Are we missing anybody? I feel like we're missing somebody. I guess not. Couldn't there be like more people? Okay, so just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class. Three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know. Why your does camp have cooked, shooting as one of those things? It's a now, real southern camp. I might camp. let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you actually. Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to right murder. Here. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets Everyone and get more really shells. Likes listening Do to not Caitlin. move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. I'm sorry, did Abby not follow us? There's no way she doesn't want to see if Nick's good at shooting, right? Yeah, okay, thank you, bye, bye. Oh, <laughs> well, the watermelons were already here, what a coincidence. So, um, how's your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? I almost got eaten by a boar. And I tried to do a playful thing and she ignored me and made me feel awkward. Because she was so concentrated in the drawing that apparently took her five seconds to make. How things with Emma? It was totally okay. Hopeful? Aww. It was... It was okay. Hey! boy. So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's... Really smart. Yeah? Mmm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. What did I look? No sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move. Before a real man swoops in. Oh, well, a real man like fucking him. Jacob can shut his ass. Speaking it's of, awesome. let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. You're you gonna kill someone on the first shot. No, this dude's gonna hit, damage. like, explode okay, a tree or something. Uh -uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're gonna do this. Oh, squats. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where Home you're aiming. Oh. Oops. I'm gonna have to use the gun later. Man, they're really giving me a little like actual to things have to do. I'm sorry to say there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry 
where you'll have to defend yourself using potential. These videos were made for the five year olds coming to camp. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Nice. Take note if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread, and injuries may not be fatal. There's a time and place for the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Remember, it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. Oh, like right now. I'm pretty sure that if I shoot right now, I'm going to hit somebody. The rest of our friends do not appear to be blatantly behind us, so kind of concerning. Wow, I'm just swinging this around, aren't I? Oh. I said I'm aiming for the left one. There's like 16 bottles. This one? This is the one I'm aiming for? Or this one? The one left of the watermelon? Okay, I need I need a clarification of the rules. I assume she said left of the watermelon, right? Just these two? All I missed. Right, Nick. One point. I didn't miss. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay. What are you setting it back up again? We have plenty All of right, bottles. Nick. It's fine. This time for real. Oh, there's a wall. Okay, we're not just shooting into the forest at random. That's nice. These two, right? So oh, this one, the leftmost. They're hiding bottles. Or just nice shot. If I fail, I have to sort over, I assume. Can I get both of these at once? Nice. Lucky. The lucky thing is if I defeat all of these so good that Dylan or what's his face doesn't get it. Done. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. Alright. Let's see what you got. Caitlin doesn't seem to like guns very much for someone who loads right. it very you smoothly. Wanna, uh, she knows what's going up. Avert your eyes, Nick. You're gonna shoot straight into this guy. I someone I don't want him to have the gun. Alright, alright. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. He's not aiming good. He's not good. Oh my goodness. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Okay, <laughs> Dude, now with this what friend, the oh, Jesus. That is how you get someone shot. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. <laughs> no, don't give him the gun back. She likes guns. She knows you have to treat them with respect. Oh, she likes. She actually likes guns more than everyone else in this place. Insane. I don't want him to have the chance to go again. I will admit, uh, as soon as he pointed it towards him, my instinctive reaction was to pull my hands up because I do this when I'm shocked, which is not a good, great thing to have happen if I'm going to have to do quick time events on the keyboard. So I'm a little concerned about my knee jerk reactions to things. Good reaction, butter boxing. I'm going to say good game because I do not want to goat him into Sorry, taking Jake. the gun back. Better luck next time. <laughs> butter luck next time? Hey, I didn't want to <laughs> say it, but you're both very mean. I mean, it's very nice that he, like, respects her gunmanship. No, she's amazing. All right. She's a warrior. Blam. We thought this was over. What the? Whoa. She's gonna get the butter pops. You can't just decide that you win. You took the gun away from him. He can have more shots. I didn't miss any of them. We didn't even attempt to shoot any of the watermelon. Was that on purpose? Secret option, open fire. It would be funny if the camera let me turn slowly far enough to actually like look at people, which would have been really spoopy, but they could have done it. Fire pit, yay. Infinitely far away from all of the cabins. You would think it might be in the middle of the cabins, but that would be silly, then we wouldn't get our exercise. Um, why is Nick sitting infinitely away from anyone else? There's 16 sitting around a campfire, 17 feet apart because we're not gay. A few of us might be gay, but we're not going to talk about it, I guess. I'm sorry, Nick. Nobody okay. likes you. Oop. New idea. Party game. Party game. Uh, Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? It's not spin the bottle, is How it? How about the ultimate game of Truth or dare. secrets and lies? Truth or dare, but Dylan style. Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. That's so, like, the normal, normal rules? Truth or dare. Except if you refuse to do it, yes. we push you off a cliff. So we can, like, make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as... 
everyone consents, of course. Oh, nice. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's Caitlin's just gonna make but... everyone kiss well, now. Does get to go first. Dylan style, so cool. Well, it's house steals, so... Abigail. Can I choose truth, truth or, dare. or dare? I want them to let me choose oh. what they choose every time. Sure. Really oh, you bullet, lame. Huh? I want a dare. Alright, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Am oh, I gonna get to choose uh, whether she lies or not? I... Interrupt. Oh, Nick's gonna interrupt? Okay, sweetie. You can you do hey, your thing. Take it easy, man. That's too far. Is it? You're a bunch of, like, Come older on. teenagers? That's the exact I'm kind of question you kind of expect, isn't it? Um, have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right. Well, the answer was actually thing. yes. Man, I thought she was nervous because she had it. All right. Okay. Um. Oh, Abby. Oh my God. Yeah. Just pick someone. I was thinking these beers were gonna okay, be not okay, enough for everybody, um, but they're kind of big, aren't they? I don't know. Ugh. Ding ding ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan. Truth or dare? An open book, dare. No, if I if I click dare, who does Emma think that Ryan wants to kiss? Does she like Caitlyn more or does she like Dylan more? He could kiss either. I think that she probably likes Caitlyn more, but I think he might be into Dylan. Honestly, dare. do it. Give me what you kiss, got. Kiss somebody. Okay, Ryan. Oh, More she's dare. giving him a choice. choice. Alright then. Can yep, whatever. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you yep. to All right, kiss then. either Caitlyn or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. I don't know why he's so popular, Sorry. man. This dude. I, <laughs> I mean, you literally just did, but okay. Let's do this. I get to choose? I haven't had a single opportunity to have an interaction between Caitlyn and them. All I know is Caitlyn's into him, but... At least him and Dylan have actually talked before, and he seemed interested, so I have no knowledge of his opinion on Caitlyn, but he likes Dylan. Dylan, let's go. Oh, I'm sorry, Caitlyn. I know you're cool, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> this game is just gonna be 100% people kissing each other. What? This is the only point for them to Always make this game. To please. Dylan, are you pleased? He doesn't seem to be saying anything. Oh, he's nervous. He's not quipping. He's not doing his sweet hot quips. <laughs> so stupid. Awkward boy. Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Right, Good okay, point. you and Jacob should kiss them. It's the only option. Jacob, uh, jump off a cliff. Nobody likes you. Okay, you know what, Caitlin? You can do something. Caitlin, what do you say? Truth or dare? Truth. Yeah, true. Let's no, you don't want to be dared to kiss Dylan? Come on. What did you want to be when you grew up? Ever hook up with Jacob? Would you ever or have you ever? This is such a boring question, but I think that this is what he when would ask. When you were a kid, what did you want to be when you grew up? Uh, that's kind of a boring question. Oh, that's what I said. Got an answer. Well, the answer is... I don't know. That's the truth. He's really good Sorry. with guns. Maybe a survivalist? So Guess it's my turn. Nope. What? I smell bullshit. I wanted to be a fairy princess unicorn, me. okay? A street I performer. Ah, oh, circus. Street performer. Theme is positive. I accept it. <laughs> no way. Well, um, <laughs> a street performer? You mean like, um, <laughs> like? No asshole. Like a mime, or you know, one of those statue guys that move when you give them a dollar. I mean, she could be a professional cosplayist, yeah, and if no, she goes out on the street, people would probably enjoy it, so it'd work. Thanks, Ryan. Well played. Mm -hmm. Now it's my turn. What if she just bet Ryan dared him Emma, to just kiss her? Dare. She just like was like, no, you're gonna kiss me this time, actually, though. We're fighting. Emma, so you have to kiss. Okay, she just run off the bat. All right, so kissing is our, what the Jacob? dares are. Or... Oh. Nick. Uh. No! Nick likes Abby. I'm gonna oh, cause man. tension if I chose that. Um, uh, sorry. Nick, this is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. No! I needed to choose this one. 
This you're gonna ruin your friendship with Abby. You know she likes him. No, he doesn't even want a kiss. Oh. Emma, you're a horrible person. Seriously? No, don't do it. No, just JK and go kiss the other No, Nick, why you were so a nod for it just a second ago. Alright. Nice. There goes the only friendship that was redeeming Emma's quality. Emma is now horrendous and nobody likes her. Why is he so into Guys. it? What the heck, Nick? Like, Emma's horrendous, but Nick was like, I don't think it's a good idea. Blah, 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 blah. Actually, that was fine. Like, come on. Okay, now he's gonna sort of beef. You gotta sit he's down. Good. Emma, you're a terrible friend. You know. God damn it. Everyone hates each other now? You're like kissing my girlfriend, asshole. It was just a game. Hey, I'm nobody's girlfriend. The fuck it was. It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Two people already Dude, split off. All right, here's up. where the murder begins, I assume. The hunt is on. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. Unless you want to come with me, Nick. Abby. Unless she's just a mastermind and she was like, I knew if I did this, Abby would storm off. Then Nick could have a chance to go fight Abby. Anybody want to play Parcheesi? Who? Parcheesi. What? It's not your fault. That was all Emma's fault. Oh, gunk. What are we supposed to do with this information? Old man Jenkins is behind us this whole time, frickin' peeves. He found a cringy. Old man murder said these these teenagers in their cringy ways. I don't even want to have to look at them. Let's just murder some other people, you know? I miss the tarot card. I can't find Welcome them. They're back. so hard to find. I am, as always, delighted that you're You're here. gonna be disappointed in the second lady. So, then, what more has been found? Nothing. Stop you dropping your cards. any more of my cards. Yet you return nonetheless. Why is that, do you think? Because I miss you and your beautiful face. I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. I would like to argue that your upper body appears Please, to be a lot smoother than the wrinkles on your face. I think there's a bit of a distortion before your face and your body. That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and the night grows dark. That's all I have to say. Why did I'll you come you here? Again. That's all I have to say. Not. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. To be fair, the first thing she ever showed me was that if I had chosen the other thing with the car, the car would have set on fire, but I happened to not choose that path by coincidence because I forgot about it. So maybe I'll just happen to not do things wrong. Maybe I'll just be that cool, you know? With the power of being suave, who needs like predictions and prophecies and whatever? 